hi everyone welcome back in my previous tutorial I shared with you how to convert word to boo and boo to word in TI Porter using the function in this part I will share with you how to convert word to boo in step 7 as requested by one of my cherished viewers Kindly subscribe if you've not done that already and also press on the notification bell. This way you will always be notified whenever I upload new video. Okay, we move on and then we have a step 7 project already created. We right click and then create a function. And this is our word to bits function. We click OK and leave the language in STL. OK, so we create our inputs. So we are going to get our in underscore word and it's going to be a word type. We create our output variables. Our first is going to be our bit zero. We have our bit one. we now create our temp variables we click on temp and then we say t underscore bit zero up to 15 ok so we now map our word to bits by creating our logic we now load our address register 1 from accumulator then we load the input word that is our input word coming into our block then we change the byte sequence in accumulator 1 in word format then we transfer the bits using this array we now use the end to map our temp variables with our outputs set the RLO and now save it ok good our logic is done we click on save and then we say save we've already started our simulator we click on download to download ok we go to the step 7 manager and then open our OB because we need to call our function in OB1 so I select ladder and then open OB1 
okay we have ob1 i go to the fc block and then drag it into my network okay i need to assign a memory addresses to the bits so i start from 0 0.0 0 0.1 and then i repeat Okay, I give it a web address now. Okay, I click on download. Yes. Now I can turn on the simulator. Okay, this is my first web. And then I have a bit, I add another bit to it, and then this is going to be my bit 0 and then my bit 1. Sorry, byte 0 and byte 1. Okay, I click on save and then download. I say yes. I go online. My PLC is in stop mode. I put it in run mode. We can see it's running. Currently, my word input is 0. And then we can see my bits are all showing off. I send 100. And then we can see my bits 6, 5, and 2 coming on. Great. And I send another word. I change to hex. And then I send a hex data. F, 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 F. And then we can see all my bits turns to 1. And then we can see at the outputs of the blog as well. Okay, I change it quickly. Back to bind decimal, sorry. And then we can see the decimal figure and then the value at the output of my blog. Great. It's working perfectly. I hope this helps someone out there. See you in the next tutorial. Bye-bye.